Yeah, welcome in. We did it again. We got a cheap hidden gem for under 100k. And as you're looking right now, when you look at my screen, you see the diamond hidden gems and you look at the days being zero and you're wondering, how do I still have the option to get it? And that's because I told y'all my la my previous video that if you put in a card before the time expires, the pack will stay around until it's fully used. Even if you never use it, it's still good because this is the diamond hidden gem at this stage in the game. Spending 100k to get it a hidden gem versus 200k for a diamond that doesn't have a lot of hall of fame badges i'll take my odds in the lottery of random hidden gems so obviously i went and got all loot doors because the iron clawed that is the amethyst we have and he is the cheapest i was able to get a lot for under 10k earlier so let's go ahead and open up our hidden gem and see what we get all right we ready we ready we here we here we here with it we here with it i got a good feeling just put in my last card so gonna go ahead and open it up. I got a good feeling about this diamond pack. We got it real cheap for one fifth of the price of what it should have been. We gonna go ahead and flip it. I'm feeling like I'm about to get a really good shooter. I got a feeling like he's about to be a cold shooter. And the offense gonna be crazy in this card is what I'm hoping for. It's gonna be somebody cold. AJ Green. I don't know why they keep giving me big man though. I don't know. AJ Green, I don't remember much about him. I don't remember anything about him. I'm not going to lie to you. I'm not going to act like I know him. But, flipping, he can't shoot. Oh, he can't shoot. I lied, I lied, I lied. Okay, he's got an 8. Wait, what's his height? Okay, he's 6'9". point shot is worse. Driving lay, 85. Standing dunk, 85. Driving dunk, 85. Ball handle, 86. And perimeter, 90. Steel 85, okay. Rebounding 90, speed better. Speed with ball 78, agility 88. Vertical 88, strength is worse though. Stamina, pass, per oh yeah, nah. He's tough, I ain't gonna lie. So I got my two power forwards, really. The only thing this card is not great at is just, he can't, his mid range is not a 94 like David West. His three point shot is a little worse. Close shot isn't the best, but this is kind of my, Popping, sh popping for, but he does have an 86 ball handle, so I'm kind of hopeful for his dribble sigs. Let's look at the badges. Okay, he only has five badges, but he does have on ball menace, which is crazy. Paint patrol and interceptor. Wait, is he a power forward center? Okay, he's a power forward center. I wish he was a small forward. That would have made him tough, but having him as my Probably my backup just because of offensively. Post move interceptor. He's 14 gold badges. He has all the badges I would want. I would add Deadeye, Limitless, Slippery, Dimer just because of my plays I run. Paint Prodigy and Setup Set Shot Specialist. Maybe Lightning Launch depending on how his dribble sakes look. But let's go ahead and replace Sharif for right now. Get a. What is it, AC green? And let's see what he looks like in the training for me. Oh, he's got the little like sidearm shit. I hate the hidden ball. Um, I haven't greened one yet. What's a hidden ball, so I can't really tell. It looks like the back of the head is the way to green it. Okay, let's try to go to Hall of Fame and see how it looks. All in all, it's not a bad jumper when wide open, I'm thinking. That's early. That was late. That's late. I'm not, I'm not disappointed yet. I feel like once I get better with his jump shot, I could be good. But still an 83, I'm going to hit an occasional jumper. There we go, we greened one. Step back. Okay. God, I don't know why you still have this hidden ball in the shoot around. I'm not mad about it. I wish I needed a point guard through small forward, but... I think he'll be tough though. Early, Jesus. Yeah, give me an actual ball. 
I would like to see an actual green ball. There we go. All right, last shot. I lied. We got a green one of these. Okay, I'm stuck with me this invisible one. I'm doing all these dribble moves and you can't even see what I'm really doing. But we greened it though. But we greened it. Yeah, I might give him light. I'm gonna give him lightning launch. Yeah, nah, he's. I'm. I'm gonna cook up with him. Yeah, nah, I'm cooking up with him. I might. I don't think he has handles for days either, so I might have to give him handles for days. But the way he's dribbling as a power forward to me is the worst shot, KD. Honestly, if we're, if we're talking about it. This is like young Kawhi power forward right here defensively. It's not like he's going to be initiating my plays, but I do have three plays where my power forward does catch a shot. So I feel confident in him the same as I do David West or not just dribbling and going to the rim. I do wish his close shot was better, so I'm not going to make any of the underneath stuff with contest, but dunking and layups. Should be a piece of cake, but he will be a monster defensively, so I'm excited about that. So all the teams that have good power forwards offensively are going to have a nightmare trying to go against this guy. But yeah. All in all, for 100k for a hidden gem compared to the stuff in the shop, I'm not bad at. I think the only other power forward that I can think of that's a diamond that is really good is Al Harrington and something with a C, I can't remember his name, that are power forwards that are under 6'10 offensively and have great defensive badges. But yeah, I would have loved to get Jamal Crawford. That's the must we want on this team for Hidden Gems is we want Jamal Crawford, but I am mad at it. I am not mad at this card one bit. AC Green, I wish you could have played small, small forward, but 83, I didn't even look at your post, like 85, rebounding 90 being better is crazy, deal 85, yeah, nah, I'm gonna, this guy's gonna be amazing, I'm, I'm happy, I'm happy about him, good pickup, good pickup, the next objective for me is hopefully the hidden gems for stealth mode go down so i can get some of those for less than 20k per card so i can get those if not i'll just buy one and put it in here for the 17 days before it expires and i'll just wait for them to go down for next season it's not the end of the world i can wait three days and then if the gems of the game amethyst ever go down i'll try to get those but if not i'm not waiting on it i'm gonna try to get one as well before it expires well this one expires in three days so i get this one first and those are the only diamonds I can attain that are in my price range of how much I play. I'm not getting any of the five. But yeah, I hope this video helped you. I hope this showed you how you can get stuff in the exchange, hold it over until you have the money to get more of them once they expire. Hope you liked my AC green pool. I wish it was a small forward or a shooting guard. But hey, we got a great card. Compared to getting Tim Duncan and Theo, whatever your name is, for the first two pools, I'm not mad at it one bit. So have a great day. Enjoy the rest of your night. I will see you in my next video either tomorrow or Wednesday.